We are the, uh, the leader in uh, transportation, uh, uh, fixed route transportation and paratransit transportation across the country. We also do shuttle operations uh, for airports uh, and for universities. We operate mostly in uh, urban environments. We want to make sure that we are always reliable, that we're always dependable, uh, and above all else, that we're always safe when we get our passengers to where they need to be. First Transit operators face the same issues that other motorists face. We do face, I think, uh, the issues differently, perhaps because of the size of the buses that we operate. We operate uh, roughly 10,000 vehicles in our fleet, uh, both large and small buses. And they are articulated buses, they are also um, paratransit vans, limousine type vehicles, shuttles uh, at the airports and on college universities. DriveCam has been helpful for us because it's, it's allowed us to reduce the number of side swipes we've had, as well as make sure that our drivers are more focused on what's in front of them and can drive their buses safely in a very populated urban environment. We know we needed to do something to uh, raise the bar on our safety, and DriveCam helped us get to where we needed to be. First Transit initially uh, faced drivers that weren't particularly uh, excited about DriveCam. We campaigned, though, to make sure that they recognized that this was a tool that was going to help them operate the buses more safely. We actually used DriveCam to identify drivers who need uh, special attention, special care. We look at the top 20 uh, riskiest drivers based on our drive cam scores and we, we give those drivers uh, special plans monthly to make sure that they are ready to drive more safely than they were the month before. I think you need to have a positive immediate consequences type of culture and I think through drive cam recognizing those drivers that have had no scored events is a perfect way to uh, establish that culture. Through the use of DriveCam, and, and I mean making DriveCam part of our culture, we have reduced our number of accidents significantly. When we first got DriveCam, we would uncover that the driver didn't have a seatbelt on. Over a very short period of time, we noticed that drivers, when there was a, a triggering of DriveCam, always had their seatbelts on. So um, that has been a very important uh, reduction for us, uh, and it's something that we take very seriously. We want to make sure that our drivers are properly belted. DriveCam has helped us accomplish that. Before DriveCam, uh, we had a high number of, of accidents, particularly side swipes, I would say. DriveCam has been very uh, instructive in the defense of litigation that we've had. DriveCam has given us the opportunity to show uh, to a jury or to plaintiff's counsel um, the event as it actually happened. First Transit had an incident uh, where we were at an intersection and we were turning left and we had the, the green light and a motorcyclist was approaching at a very high rate of speed. But drive cam clearly showed that we were well within the turn when the impact by the, uh, by the motorcyclist happened. We wouldn't have been able to prove it as well as we were able to prove it uh, because it would have been his word against ours. First Transit has really benefited from the uh, monthly reporting provided to us uh, by uh, drive cam. DriveCam is a great tool I would recommend to any safety professional. I think that it, ha it is transformative, it has done great wonders for our company in terms of reducing uh, the number of accidents, and anyone who had a limited amount of money uh, or were looking for that one item that they wanted to purchase uh, to uh, change their safety culture, DriveCam, would, without doubt, would be the tool I would purchase.